I told you we were gonna draft you. Flowers for the score! Oh, wow, Zay Flowers. You Another are play. an excellent player. You are gonna be an amazing part of our offense for years and years to come. Get a call, Zay Flowers, NFL, Baltimore Ravens, number one draft pick, Broward County's finest, telling me that he's got a hitch in his giddy up. You know, when this guy trains, he fucking trains, he goes all out. We call him Ferrari feet behind his back. I don't know if he knows that. I think he might. But either way, he's always six gear, always going, going, going. When he feels like he's going from six gear down to fifth gear, I get the text. And that's what we got today. What's up, Beto? Good to see you. How are things? Good. Good? Chilling, you look better yeah. than ever. You motivated you, me to stop wearing shoes. To start wearing shoes or stop? stop? Yeah, fuck yeah, bro. Every time I work out, I don't got no shoes. No, 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 I got no. on sandals. <laughs> I, I, was, I was about to go to work out, so I was like, I gotta wear sandals. Okay. But you've been training barefoot? Every day. And? Feel feels good. Feels good, right? Yeah. yeah. Since last time I saw you, it was combine time. Yep. Anything I need to know about? Uh. Anything new? Nah, not you know? really, nah. Same old, same old Zay Spine? Yep. Gotcha. Tuck your chin just a little bit. Good. Big breath in. I'm gonna feel me work this area real quick, all right? Gotcha. You okay in this heat? Yep. This ain't nothing for you, right? Nah, I'm good. I'll be training this all day. So first thing I'm gonna do is loosen up the tissue around the base of his skull and his brainstem area here. Imagine how many years Zay's worn a helmet for, all that compression. All the power neurologically lives in the upper neck. It's not just here, but it flows through the entire body. Look to the left for me. So it's a really important area to not have compression and to make sure those joints slide and glide. And then the muscle and tissue that crosses over those joints is healthy as well. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Dude, that was good. That was him. Uh-huh, for sure. Right. I'm gonna hold here. Got you. Ooh. Oh, nice, bro. That was a lower rib head for you. That'll help with breathing. I don't know if you see the transformation, because you guys probably see each other all the time. Oh, no. But from the first time I met you, to even what you look like body-wise, physically face, dude, you've matured crazy, crazy. And he was built then, but it's like, I've already seen it from like year two to now, it's crazy. Yeah. Right? When you first started adjusting me, yeah. my, what, my junior year? I feel like it, yeah, somewhere yeah. in that range. Yeah, it was probably a and big And you were difference. built then, but you still had more of like the boyish kind of, yep. like upgrade Body. from senior year. Yeah. But now, it's a whole nother level, you know? Another year from now, he's gonna be fucking insane. Personally, I don't know what it is, but I always see Zay's IG posts when I'm on a cheat meal. And I hate it because nowadays every every one of his posts he's got an eight pack in. I'm like, what the fuck? Really? <laughs> nah, but your workouts be crazy though. Yeah, no, mine are crazy. You gonna feel me bring this arm up like this? Big breath in. One to ten, what's that right there? That's acid, like a six. Yeah, for sure. A little tight as hell. What number right there? Uh, like a, it's like seven. Okay, big breath in. Ooh. Exhale. Whoa, that's like, yeah. I got you, bro, I got you. I'm gonna hook this foot over this foot like this. Good. And you're just gonna feel me walk up it, okay? Yeah. One to ten.
What's that right there? I said an eight. Now, eight, right, right there. Okay. Okay. Lay on the right side, face me. Ooh. Yeah, that was always done in my hips. Yeah, right I here. know. It's the blessing and the curse. Yeah. Of the speed and the power. <laughs> that every day get tight all the time. Exactly. Yeah. You're gonna feel me right on that spot, all right? Oh! Oh, yeah. Whew. Yes, sir. Okay, now I wanna go on your back. Yep. That's it, the right, that's it. Exact spot. Yeah, that was hole in one shape. Yeah. Right there. It's right where it attaches. You gonna feel me on these feet? Yeah. Oh. These are Hall of Famer feet already. Facts. Right? Facts. Ferrari feet. Ferrari feet. I'm gonna bring this leg over here like this. You're gonna feel me hook you this way. You okay with that motion there? Yeah. Okay. Tight, ain't it? <laughs> yeah. Yes, it is. <laughs> Take this foot and push against my hand. Gotcha. Push, 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 and relax. Push, push, push. Good. All right, relax this hip for me. There it is. Beautiful. You feel that open up right there? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, now hips in the center. I want you to turn this foot in like this. Good. One to ten. Where am I at right now, just with that pressure? Not Nothing? Bad. Okay. Yeah. Where right there? Yeah, I see like a six. Six, okay. Yeah. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take from the femur, from the leg bone here, not the foot, and turn it out like that for me, so okay? Like yep, you're gonna turn it out. Yep, exactly. Turn it in, and then turn it out. Turn it, turn, 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 turn. Yep, oh, you just turn like the that. foot too? Turn the foot too, yep. But just drive from the leg, uh-huh. Good, drive from the leg, yep. Good, and again, drive from the leg. Yep, now hold there. <laughs> I would take off my shirt, but <laughs> I'm trying to focus on Zay right now, and if that happens, no one's gonna be even paying attention. <laughs> All right, this foot's gonna turn in like this. Gotcha. Same thing, okay? I'm gonna start on the upper part here, one to 10. First, what is that? Like a six. Seven. A six already up top yep. on that same side, okay. Is your dominant leg your right leg or your left leg? Oh, my right. Your right leg? Yep. Gotcha. Okay, turn it in, or turn it out, excuse me. Yep, good, and relax. Good. And go, yep. Ooh. You feel that movement in that muscle belly yeah. right there? Yep. Go, 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 go. Good. Perfect, thank you. I'll take it from here. Okay, now face me on this side. Let's get on this hip. Ooh. Good, this hand up top like this. Damn. Oh, there we go. Shit. Whew. Whew. Yeah. That's what I've been needing. I try to save them for the end, so when I go back to practice or when I go back to the facility, I'm already fresh. I got everything I need, body feeling good. Now we running. He the best. He the best in the business. It, it, nobody else to hit up. I don't even know nobody else. Every time I come to it, I feel brand new. Do you feel like it changes the way you perform? Hell yeah. Like, I feel like my body more like loose and like I can be able to do what I want more. Then I'll be a tight, hips tight, legs tight. Like, I feel like I got a lot of pressure on my body. Big breath in. Hold this one. Awesome. Shit. <laughs> that shit's moving. Moving real good. What? Good. Yeah, it's about to get scary when we go back. Absolutely. 
your shit is like next, Crazy, next, right? next, next level. Yeah. And I'm not just saying that because I know you. I'm like fucking watching you. I'm like, what the fuck? That's why I work out so much. Like, I try to get everything as close as I can. <laughs> Dude, I don't even know if explosive is the word, man. I know you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. It's crazy. I don't know if it's the camera that does that or that's you, but it's nuts, right? I, it's just crazy. All right, back to work. I'm going to hold in this position. You're going to feel me hold at the base. Good. One more breath like that for me. Exhale. Beautiful. Oh, shit. Ooh. God. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. God. Oh, my God. That boy's just not like 10 years off my neck. You gotta get that out of there. I was telling, <laughs> out of there, <laughs> out of there. All right, so I was telling the guys earlier that you're really like the newest modern athlete of the new generation, where like you've got all the strengths of the greats before you, but you're really dialed in to every other aspect, you yeah. know, and will probably grow in a whole new way in that regard, you know? Yeah. Um, I think that's super cool because it's about extending shelf life on your body, you know? So you look at maybe some of your ideal, like who you looked up to yeah. and you see it like, for example, I know they've got blown ACLs, torn MCLs. And I know that part of that just comes with the game, yeah. but part of it is maybe loss of, you know, joint movement or a restriction in their body and playing on top and training on top of these dysfunctions and imbalances that they never really cued into or dialed into. And here you are just firing on all cylinders. It can only mean if you plan or get hit wrong, your ability to bounce back is going to be way better. Yeah, that's, you know, you know what right. I'm saying? Do you that's feel like, like that or is yeah, that that's just... that's one of my main focuses. Yeah. Like if you ask them, ask them how many times we drive around going to like... Yeah, different treatment, places for recovery, recovery treatments, yeah. yeah. Like yeah. all type of stuff. No, I've always gotten that vibe off you, you know, go, from even yeah. college days. Yep, yeah. train... Where did that come? I mean, I'm just putting those pieces of the puzzle together, but where does that come from? Because I take care of a ton of athletes and I've noticed that some yeah. can give two shits until shit hits the fan. Yep. And then they're like, they're looking for the Jesus effect. You know, where's that magic stem cell where they could either pay to get their way out of yep. it, which never works, yep. you know, or get some type of shot, pill, potion, lotion. And then others are just fucking about it from day one. Yeah. Where, 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 I mean, I just feel like... Where's that come from? I just feel like, because body, my body, my temple... Yeah. And shit, if it's not strong enough, I won't be able to play. For sure. So I just feel like if I can get everything in and keep my body as strong as possible. Yeah. And try to stack on that every day. Yeah. And do what Did I that, can to keep it strong. Yeah. That's what I do, no matter what it is. But let's say you were playing with some kid in high school, right? And yep. we're in college, right? You guys went from high school to college. Two people grew up in the same environment. One puts emphasis on his body, one doesn't. Is the coach the difference is it more family driven like uh, where is one person like you picking it up and another because like you say that and to me i'm like dude everybody should come from the place of my body is my temple it's how i perform it's how i make money yep. it's you know my future yep. not just my present that just is that should be common sense yeah, I say where do bad. some people miss the bus i mean were you around a coach did you uh, have a specific person in your life that uh, kind of drove not that really home? i say mine was just mental just mental. mine was like just, so i meet this person he do this so Oh. He's good at this, then I'll try ah, to build okay. a relationship, get gotcha. it there, yeah. and see what I can learn to take care of my body. So, like, probably over the years, I probably learned something from everybody to take care of my body. So, I'll be at home doing hamstring curls. Yeah. I'll be in my dorm doing hamstring curls, doing, like, yeah. Why? Like, what a, for your position? Hamstrings. Uh, hamstrings explosive. Are every, explosive? Explosive. You feel like the most important muscle? Is a, my hamstring. Is your hamstring? My glute muscles. Really? Yeah. Shit. And then my I knew VMOs. that for vertical. And then my and VMO. The VMO. Yep. So the two things you hit the most are VMO yep. and hamstring. Absolutely. From day one. From day one. Who, do you I feel remember like who it was who first started To stop telling? and start, uh -huh. if, if you want to punch in the ground, yeah. these got to be strong. Yeah. And your quads and your hamstrings got to yeah. be strong. And then uh -huh. I built it like, before my Damn. upper body was built like this, my yeah. lower body was already strong enough yeah. to handle everything. Yeah. So now it's just building yep. the top part. My dad always put yeah. emphasis on every like lower body, lower body. Keep your lower body really? strong. Yeah. That shit. You still tell me to this day my lower body not strong enough. <laughs> I'm like, You're I'm by the way, full plates. I don't know uh, who knows this about you, but I'll save them a Google search. Is you are how many how many brothers and sisters? One of fourteen. One of fourteen. Yeah. Dude, that's crazy. It's crazy. And are you the baby or no? Uh, I'm a number eleven right here. Got it. Oh, number eleven. Yeah, number eleven. Oh. I see that. Almost done. Yeah, three under me, two little brothers, one sister. Um, my little brother go to Bowling Green. Okay. He just got there like two yeah. weeks ago. Yeah. 
He big Everyone though. Everyone in your family must be fucking ecstatic, huh? Yeah, everybody like, athletes. crazy. Yeah. But like family, community, local neighborhood, closest neighbors. Everybody. Teachers from high school. Like, everybody. Yeah, everybody, right? Yeah, because I wouldn't say they ain't expect it, but like yeah. just growing up, you know what I mean? Like Let me it was it was that. always people that was like five stars, four stars, like that was yeah. bigger. Is that, you think, I was just going to say, because of height, or they were like, hey, we know he's got the talent, yeah. but, but there's the but. Yeah, the height. Yeah. It was always it the was height. It was always height. It was always height. Yeah? Yeah. You ever feel like, did you have a moment in time where you were like, shit, I wish I was fucking 6'5"? Hell no. I love my height. Have. I love. You've always been like, yo, no, committed. Because nobody could do what I could do. Yeah. I agree. Stop and I start. Agree. Nobody can do that. There's a upside to that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. To stop and start, I can And even if they could, they couldn't do it as long as you could do Facts. it. Your shelf life would yep. be way better on that regard. Yeah. Yep. So I never care about height. Mm. <laughs> they used to tell me, oh, third round. For I'm like, bro, I'm going first round. I don't know what y'all talking about. Yeah, you've been preaching that since I met you. Yeah. So is your close inner circle that I knew. Yeah. You know? Yeah. In fact, even the first time I met you, I didn't. I couldn't believe. I was like, "Holy shit, this guy's like my height, basically." Yeah. You know? How yeah. is he such a badass at my height? What the fuck? <laughs> but then I watched you. And then when you, that next time I came I back, you told to, me. I just I went. I remember exactly. I yeah. looked you up, and I was like, "Holy shit!" Yeah. Holy shit! <laughs> I knew it right then and there. Yeah, man. I just take care of that lower body and take care of you. In it. I've been having them work out with me for the last like two weeks. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Kicking your ass? <laughs> Good. <laughs> All right. Oh, this is the best part. It's showtime. <laughs> what I'm going to do first, because you've been out here a little bit, I'm just going to make sure you're not sweating so I don't gotcha. slide off you. Yeah. One time I slid off some guy's neck and broke his neck. I'm just totally going to do this. It's a bad time. All right. Big breath in first. Good. Exhale. With football players, getting back to compression, it's a word that really you just, it's always going to be in almost every conversation when it comes to health, mechanics, body, etc. is so important to bring his joints through all ranges of motion to make sure he's not losing one degree in one plane. And what we're doing right now is stair-stepping and bringing his joints and his neck through these ranges of motion before we open them up for that money shot adjustment. That way it gets him the best effect and the most therapeutic value for what its sole purpose is. You know, feel me? Come underneath here. Big breath in for me, Z. Exhale. Good. There's still something there. Hang on. You okay with me there? Mm-hmm. You feel that right there? Yeah. Yeah. This is where it's all about the chef in the kitchen. You want to just grab someone's neck and pull. Good. I want to make sure that meat is tenderized. That is perfect. <laughs> <laughs> all right, TT, get it for me, big And big breath in. Focus on that breath. Yeah. Big breath in again. Exhale. Beautiful. Woo. Woo. Boy, I done seen the light. Marinate there for a second. Let me get this. That's... Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, for sure. <laughs> Are you going to train after this? Or you done for the day? I, I was supposed to drive to um, Corey Gables. Oh shit! To run with O and uh, Jarvis. Shit. And Goldfeet. Damn. But I might have to call it. I yeah. might have to let the body rest. I agree. Oof. Oh my Oof. God, bro. That was good movement in there, bro, all the way around. <laughs> Hips opened up nice. Feet opened up nice. Knees, everything. Everything. Yeah. Whew. Doc, Ooh. you done brought hell on some people at camp. Yeah, well, that was my game plan. That's why I made sure no matter what, even if I'm off, <laughs> I had to get to you. Yeah. Yeah. Good. I want you to go ah. Uh. <laughs> Tell you. I bought this baby spit. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Small little feature. <laughs> oh. Uh, let it go, let it go. Oh, bingo. Oh, yeah. Bruh, my eye, I'm <laughs> That 
That was like a delayed reaction right yeah. there, right? It was like it was, loading. It was like this. <laughs> All right, so you just watched me adjust Zay. Round one. Yeah. Known him for a long time. Since I've met him, recovery's been a huge staple in his programming, and I've seen that from the minute I met him. Um, and to see it now full circle to where his career continues to take off, I just wanted to, more than anything, capture on camera how important it is, not only for the person watching, but even for someone at the level you're at, at the top level, uh, how important recovery is, how important body care is, you know, coming from a place, a mindset of your body is your temple, and when you take care of that, anything's possible, you know? Yep. And seeing that, especially because if you guys are looking, we're about the same height. Yep. Now, I'm average height, so I'm not okay. saying you're small because I like to at least think I'm average height. But someone who's probably always heard the story in the narrative of, man, if only he was 6'4", 6 6'5", 6 6 6, yep. and someone who's taken care of the body, been obedient to it, had the right habits in place, the right coaches, right team, right people in place. And to see where you're at now, knowing that, in my opinion, you're a future Hall of Famer, I think it speaks to itself. Uh, I say recovery is the biggest thing because without your body you can't do nothing so you can you won't be able to do the things on the field that you need to do without taking care of your body so my dad always made it a point keep your lower body strong yeah um take care of your body take care of your body because yeah. your body gonna get you where you want to go yeah and do, what I, do you think you have the jump not necessarily on one person but just almost on yourself yeah. of having that habit so early on in your career versus yeah. adopting it maybe year three after god forbid god forbid god forbid an injury yeah. you know what i mean you feel yeah. like that's served you up until this point yeah like i've been doing i would say i've been taking care of my body since ninth grade 10th grade yeah and it's awesome like it's been helping me yeah. like no injury free injury free yeah. knock on wood yeah um haven't had an injury never missed a game in college yeah and just being able to take care of my body and get ahead of the game early, yeah. it just put me on notice that I'm already ahead of everybody that's yeah. lacking my age. Yeah, and, I mean, I see that. You know, when, when I look at like all the variety of people I take care of, um, you're like probably the most ideal person. It doesn't mean I don't love everybody, yeah. but you're just so dialed in. It's like, I almost don't even need to talk to you. You just get on the table. I'll adjust you because I know everything else is already in place, so to speak, you know? It's just yeah. so fluid is what I'm trying to say. Uh, let me ask you one other question though. Uh, in terms, of recovery we say like okay recovery is important yeah but for someone watching right now that might be oh so once a week he probably gets in a hot tub or a cold bath <laughs> what is what does it really look like in your world recovery you know because for example i might say man i spend an hour out here in the heat it feels like it was all day to me but yeah. for you it's nothing you know what i mean yeah. so one day out of seven might feel like a lot recovery wise for some guy just out here watching the video. Yeah. Uh, but what is it really for you? Like, so when someone's grinding, they're like, you know what? I'm already doing one thing. I hear what Zay's saying, shit, I could really step up my game. Yeah. What does it look like? Is so, it a five day a week thing? Is it oh, seven? Every day. It's every, every day. day. Every day. There's I, some form of recovery. It's some form of recovery. Like, whether it's steam room, I'm stretching in the steam okay. room. Yeah. Whether I'm um, with doc, doc, okay. um, it's someone that takes care of me. Yeah. Yep, tissue uh -huh. work. Yep. Um, mm -hmm. I even do stuff on my own. Like, I mm -hmm. do like little exercises in the room. That just, just like balanced stuff, balance. strength. Yep. Um, awesome. Push-ups, um, hamstring work. Could could recovery be listening to your body? Like you just got adjusted, right? You were thinking, okay, maybe I'm gonna go go run with the yep. guys. But you know what? Maybe my body feels like it needs to rest. Is yep. that a form for you of recovery? Yeah, like 100%. just really not listening to what someone else says, but listening to your own body in terms of how far you could push it before you go. You know what? I need to just chill and relax, decompress for the day, and then tomorrow clean slate. One hundred percent. Because if you start like forcing it, I yeah. feel like your body want to um react yeah. the same yeah like if you just listen to your body and do yeah. what your body need it's easier it's way easier yeah i see that bless you bro thank you so much for your time